It's early May in New York, and we've had to use the cover of darkness to slip in and get set up along this field edge. Mark was able to watch two big longbeards leave this field the evening before, just before fly-up. The plan was to put the field behind us and call these two gobblers up this beautiful hardwood knob that fell off the back of the field. What we didn't know was that there was a third longbeard, and he had decided to roost right on the field edge. It wasn't a huge deal. We just spun around the tree. The only problem with that was we were now behind a hedgerow that bordered the field which made us have to video and shoot through the tangled mess. Couple this with the bird flying down extremely early. The footage may be a bit grainy and a bit scattered, but in the end, the result's the same. This big boy stayed at the fringe of gun range for what seemed like forever, just showing out, gobbling and strutting and really doing his thing. But eventually the quiet game got the best of him. He stretched his wings and came on in. Thank you. It's uh, April, I mean May. What is it right now? I ain't been working so long, I don't even know what day it is. Yeah. May 5th. Oh, dude, it's May 2nd. 3rd. May 3rd. Um, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, it's May 3rd. Um, slipped in here this morning, Mark had put two birds to bed on down on this knob. We slipped in here, right on the edge of the field, and uh, put the decoy in the field and was ready for these birds out in front of us 100 yards or so to gobble. And this guy popped up right behind us. I mean, he was right on the edge of the field. We actually were set up perfect for him. We just had to flip around the tree and move the camera. And we hadn't done any kind of trimming and these field edges are super thick. So uh, it was kind of a kind of a uh, bang bang play. But uh, I think we got some decent footage. I, like I said, it was thick on these field edges and we were uh, having to shoot through all of it, but. Yeah, it was rough to say that at least. Yeah. <laughs> but we, uh, 
<laughs> we were able to, able to get it done.